Rest in peace to Dave Mira. Unfortunately, it was inspired by the news I heard this morning on the way to work that Dave Mir passed away. And it actually got me thinking about how he inspired and set me up at 2000 when I first played his game, Dave Mir Freestyle BMX, to get me where I am now here on Shockley TV. So I wanted to give you guys a little info on that and paint a little picture for you to see why I feel like he is a reason for where I'm at right now. It's 2000, December 25th, you know, Christmas time. My parents had set up all the Christmas gifts downstairs. My pops had a TV covered. We didn't know it was a TV. It was covered in a sheet on top of a desk. And you know, my brother and me, we didn't know what it was. We knew it was a big gift, so we just sat onto the side, wait till all the other gifts over. So we go over to that gift, pull off the cover. It's a TV, big old TV. You know, back in the day, the huge TV with the back end on it. Big TV, and of course, a PlayStation. Now we already had a PlayStation, but it had two controllers hooked up to it. And the one game that was on there, Dave Mir Freestyle BMX. Now, when I tell you guys that game was played non-stop, 24-7 by me and my brother, we learned every song that was on the soundtrack, every level, I completed any and everything I could because somehow that game connected to me on multiple levels, especially as far as for hip hop and of course my completion style of gaming. I'm really into um, getting everything with games. Like if there is a set list of items you have to complete or things you must do, I'm really set on getting those and trying to get 100% on games. That's what I do, that's what I love. So I love those kind of adventure story games, you know, Legend of Zelda, and uh, recently like Watch Dogs or you know, Batman, all these games that have those multiple tasks that you have to complete and items you have to get, I'm all into that. And that's first got put into me from that Dave Bear BMS game because you have to complete these certain tasks in order to move throughout the level. You have to get a certain amount of points. You have to get these certain letters to spell the word in order to get the different clothes, the different bikers, the different sounds and music. All those things were included in that game and nothing before that Christmas inspired me until that, especially with the soundtrack. Now, anybody who's played the Dave Mir BMS games know that he was heavily into hip hop. There's an actual picture I'm gonna show you guys where actually DJ Premier said today on his Instagram, Dave Mirror was really into Gangstar, which is what inspired me to get into Gangstar and, and directly into DJ Premier, who is hands down my favorite producer of all time. Any musician you know has indirectly or directly worked with him to make a beat, produce a song, get connected with somebody. He's my all-time favorite producer, and he's a part of the group Gangstar, which is the second all-time favorite group of mine next to Outkast. Now, Dave Mirror introduced me to him because of a song called Moment of Truth. I played that song over and over and over. It's actually the song you're hearing in the background of this video. I could not get enough of the song and the message that it was given, and it just made me change my hip-hop perspective as far as looking for artists and finding new sounds and beats and producers because prior to that I was just going off what my dad was listening to you know Tupac, Biggie, all those artists but that actually pushed me into finding out what other artists there were and try to get into other games to see what other music they had because back in the day you know all the cool games like Tony Hawk and even Madden all those sport games had the cool music that you don't really get to hear on the radio so all these underground artists were introduced to me from the Dave Mirror Gang, which is what I'm heavily into now in hip hop, which is why I do so many rap and hip hop off the album views on my channel today. So the cool thing that I feel through the Dave Mirror Freestyle BMS game, it brought me to two of my favorite things in life, gaming and music. So shout out just to give you guys a final thought, Dave Mirror's first game, Freestyle BMX, is pretty much the reason behind what Shadow TV is, from the gaming, the music, my personal interest, all that was pretty much planted seed-wise straight from that game on PlayStation. So I did want to make this video, do give my condolences to the Dave Mirror family, and we will always be fans of his no matter what, and uh, that's how we're going to end it, y'all. Shadow TV, out.